in custody tonight after he held police at bay inside a convenience store in Wilkesbury. The man told those inside Turkey Hill on North Washington Street he had a knife and was strapped with a bomb. Eyewitness News first brought you this story as it unfolded in a live stream on PAHomepage.com. The I team's Andy Mahalshik joins us now live from the scene. Andy? Well, good evening, Candace. Investigators identify the suspect as 33 year old Brandon Trasuski from Waymart in Wayne County. They tell me this was a very tenuous situation that could have ended very badly. It actually made me hesitate before I got out of the car. I wanted, I wanted to see what this guy was up to. My instincts, were, my instincts were correct. Martin Shanahan was parked in front of the Turkey Hill store on North Washington Street in Wilkesbury just after noon on Sunday. He was about to go in and buy a pack of cigarettes when the drama unfolded before his eyes. Basically, I took the store hostage, came from the side of the building, dressed in a very weird getup, looked like he had armor on his, on his forearms. Uh, <laughs> he shut the door, aggressively locked it. And just took the store over from that point until you no know, cops showed up shortly after. The initial call was that it was an armed robbery and hostages. The suspect was in the Turkey Hill with hostages. Wilkesbury City Police and state troopers surrounded the store. They sealed off a three block area. We negotiated the fact that the uh, uh, hostages could be released and then we continued to negotiate with him until he turned himself in. The hostages, at least three Turkey Hill employees, came out the front door. About an hour later, Trzuski surrendered, but the drama wasn't over yet. He made the claim that he had a, uh, a, a bomb, and that's why we have the bomb squad coming to clear the uh, Turkey Hill. And the Scranton bomb squad used a robot to enter that store three times. It removed two backpacks and a floor mat. Officers later dragged a trash can from inside the store. There was no bomb found inside the backpacks or anywhere in the building. Police say they do not know what Trzuski's motive was. That remains under investigation. He's locked up tight, unable, unable to post bail. Now, the employees, Turkey Hill employees who were inside the store at the time, say they're simply too upset to make any comment about that situation. Reporting live in Wilkesbury, Luzerne County, Andy Mahal, Chicago Witness News. Scary afternoon there, Andy. Thank you. And Trzuski is charged with unlawful restraint, terroristic threats, and theft. Here are